Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to yet another Fallout 76 video on the channel today. This is the second one. The previous one was all about the patch notes. We just got an update for the game, releasing a bunch of bug fixes and quality of life changes. So if you want to check that out, feel free to check out the previous video after this one. However, this one right now, we're going to be going over the Atomic Shop and all the new things that's coming in there. And I think I've already seen a kind of little bit of a... A little insight and there is something new in there so let's find out if you enjoy hit the like button make sure to subscribe and let's dive straight into the atomic shop this week so we have bum 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 a lot of new stuff guys so we've got a new free states resistance bundle which is 1500 and you can't see right now but i have 1468 atoms which is extremely inconvenient anyways let's have a look so the bundle itself is this right here and it's got the free states resistance backpack which you've probably just seen on the main screen the wasteland debris the last stand which i'm not sure what that is i'm guessing it's oh the last stand is that then the patch notes is actually talking about a last stand which i think is this prefab right there which you can see uh which looks all right to be fair i'll be interested to see what it looks like inside because obviously you've got that plane on the top how does the stairs kind of line up and stuff that'll be interesting you also get the independent sword the free states resistance outfit free states resistance uh helmet as well that outfit actually looks really really cool i really like that and the helmet to match as well it's brilliant and also the pvc curtain door there's the backpack there's the sword which also looks really nice i actually really like that so there is the curtain door as well very similar to just the plain curtain door we've had in the past and there is the debris so there you go lots of stuff in this bundle i think to be fair you get a backpack and outfit uh, uh prefab and also the debris a curtain and this weapon skin 1500 i suppose compared to some of the ones we've seen in the past isn't too bad can't really complain about that i really like this outfit a lot and i really like the backpack to match as well so this might have to be a buy for me i might need to buy it who knows um but yeah overall not too bad let's take a look at the other pictures so there's also the revolutionary bundle which is here which is that one with a stupid amount of items so i'm not going to read all that out if you want to pause it read through them feel free but this is an old item with lots of old uh stuff in survivalist bundle exactly the same has 20,000 items in it and it is up for sale it's an old one so feel free to pause it if you want and just have a little quick read through all this it's skins maybe outfits and some signs as well so lots of different things in there going on to the new things though this is the last stand prefab it's 700 atoms to buy it on its own and it looks to be somewhat of an r its size as well uh we've got the little door at the kind of bottom there that leads in then we've got the bit up the top this is the entrance into the top bit i'm presuming uh it's got a little bit of a balcony so oh, all right so you must go in like a zigzag in the bottom door round up around up so you know what i mean so like I don't, know, I don't know how to pronounce it. I don't know how to describe that. But yeah, hopefully you can understand from the pictures the layout of the thing. Overall, it doesn't look too bad. Quite small. Uh, I do have this thing where I keep buying prefabs and never using them. But yeah, let me know what you think about that in the comments. The outfit, I actually really, really do like this outfit. I think that looks really cool. And I wish they would add in some kind of new free states kind of elite with this resistance maybe this resistance comes back out and comes into the game i'm asking a lot here but it would be awesome if they added that in and all of a sudden we find this kind of uh, resistance that's been hiding in one of the vaults or something like that that'll look really cool independence that is the sword right there i actually like the look of that it looks pretty cool uh the backpack we've seen curtain door and also the wasteland debris down the bottom for 500 350 and the debris 250 Going on the next page is all the stuff that came in last week. I didn't buy any of this. I didn't do a review on it or anything like that. I've realised not that many people actually watch the reviews, so I might stop them unless something uh, dramatically fantastic comes out. But yeah, all this stuff did come in last week and still available if you want to pick it up. As a kind of rundown, 1800 atoms, you get the military huddle love pose, the military huddle cheer pose, Taggarty's Thunder paint for the power armors, which you can see there, the Brother to Steel chassis display frame, Taggarty's Thunder power armor paint, hang on no, Taggarty's Thunder paint is for the pit boy, sorry, uh, Brother to Steel guard post, military huddle kneel pose, and the Brother to Steel porch kit as well. So lots of stuff in that bundle, if you haven't got it and you're thinking about buying it, there you go. But yeah, lots of stuff down below there if you want to pick it up, and also the Brotherhood bundle is here, including the Steel Rain power armor paints, Brother to Steel head wraps, Brother to Steel armor and the high-tech stash box as well then we've got the power armor by itself going on to the greatest hits now we have oh look at that that's something i'm saying while the atomic lamp 
Um, the greenhouse kit as well is in here as well. This is the rustic one though, not the clean looking greenhouse one. This is the rustic one as you can see in the pictures. That's up for sale this week. We've also got the camouflage bundle which is for power armor. You also get short suit, wasteland walk, power armor, camouflage, leather armor, paint, camouflage, hunting rifle. Uh, combat armor, tactical pin for the pump action shotgun, camouflage suit, and camouflaged metal armor as well. I actually like the suit, it's quite funky. Uh, vault tech bundle, a very old one, this one, including vault tech metal armor paint, vault tech hunting rifle, uh, fat man paint, leather armor paint, vault tech paint for the pit boy, combat armor paint, vault tech suit, uh, laser gun paint, and also the vault tech um, short suit as well so there you go lots of stuff going on in that one wildman rags up for 490 and also we've got the gold 50 caliber paint for 350 deathclaw pelt rug for 210 and the armored raider skull gas mask for 210 as well vault and section oh vault and section is all the stuff that came out the other week which is the ball and stuff i just bought this the other day um a while because i thought it was like the last week of it having it but this turns out this will be the last week of having it in the store so if you want to buy that it's still available you can get it this week Final page now, we have... Da, 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 ooh, is that daily offer thing already? Right, okay, so... Bit of a bit of a strange one here, guys, right? So we've got the Bodyguards icon, which is for free. Daily item is the free supply package right there. But also the Iron Maiden uh, bed is here, which should be until... Available June 2023. Nice. Uh, didn't add that into all the bug fixes. It just did, did they? Uh, weekly item, we have the Scabber bundle, which includes the Scabber tire backpack, Scabber pin for the handmade, Scabber power armor skin, Raider Scabber flag, Raider Scabber outfit, Scabber mask, Scabber icon, Scabber flag again, Scabber paint again. Uh, so yeah, lots of different Raider themed items. Why does he look so like, like a lamppost? Um, but yeah, and there's also the sap collector as well. These on the bottom are all fallout first, just in case you didn't notice. Uh, sap collector, I'm going to presume you've got to buy this one. It was a fallout first free item, was it? Or did it come in a bundle? I can't remember now off the top of my head. Uh, but yeah, that's also up for fallout first users. And the daily item I'm presuming is the cultist dungeon gimp suit. So there you go. <laughs> but yeah, that's the Atomic Shop for this week, guys. Let me know what you think in the comments of the new bundle. For me, that armor looks fantastic. Well, out outfit even. I really love the outfit. I love the backpack as well. So I am debating buying this bundle. But let me know what you think. Are you buying it? Drop it down in the comments. And I'm going to leave the video there for today. So hope you all enjoyed. If you did, make sure to click on that like button. Subscribe if you're new. And I will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.